Good morning, everyone online. Okay, talk just, just a little louder for me, Sam. Uh, when I go to update the COVID cases on campus. Say that one more time, Sam. On the ISU campuses operation level, when are they going to update that? Um, it updates every Wednesday. Yeah, see, I can't see any updated one. I could only see the ones from November 11th, 2020. Good. Let me take a look, All right, Sam. You. But I believe that it updates every Wednesday. I'll take a look at what's up there right now. Do you need to plug in? Nah. Okay. I've like never seen a Windows map before. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> uh, yes, I have. Oh, yeah. I have a Windows map. Oh, really? Yeah. You can? Yeah, I just downloaded it from a boot. Yeah. Yeah, I have a boot. Camp. I do that mine. Yeah. Uh, I have a two. Sold, just sold a 2008 iMac. Uh -huh. With the Windows on it? And with Windows and Mac, it's split, split oh, hard drive. Yeah, and uh, it worked pretty well, but I mean, what do you expect for a you know, 12 year old computer? Yeah. It couldn't handle, couldn't handle it, so we ended up going to a, a Windows. Mine was 2012, and I think I'm good. Yeah. Where technology is starting. McKinsey, can you do my attendance? Sure. Oh, were you doing too? Sure. Can you do mine too, please? Is that Haley and Jennifer who just asked? Yes, please. Yes. Yeah. Sam, do you want me to get yours too? I got it. Thank you, Dave. Okay. Okay. Oh, that they, they can do it. All right, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. So we'll apply for graduation real quick. Uh, whoever is applying, whoever is graduating this semester will apply. Okay. So let's go on to Bengal Web. Yeah. If we've already applied, do we need And you were just chilling. Okay. Just chilling. <laughs> on the left-hand side, you'll see academic tools. On the right hand side, once the page refreshes, you'll see graduation planning, I believe it is, or graduation tools. And then you'll see apply to graduate. Go ahead and click on that. And then it'll come up with uh, two degree options. Is that correct? Term, sorry, select like term, uh, East spring 21. Is that right? Yep. Take it back off you. I have a completely different view on mine. Mm -hmm. I'm going off my. <clears throat> All right, spring 21. Then you're going to select uh, select the top one, which is Associate of Applied Science. Okay. Now, if you want the intermediate technical certificate, you have to go back and do it again. It's an additional twenty dollars if you want to do that. Okay. So hey, let's everyone do the AAS and then continue. I did both of mine at the same time. Uh, I don't think the system allows you to do that. 
because it, it, it selects it, it's kind of it's like you either choose one or the other. You have to go back in again and do it again. Uh, graduation date, then you're going to select uh, May 7th, uh, 21. Continue. And then uh, select your name for your diploma and just put down either current or legacy, doesn't matter because the next, when you hit that, it's going to scroll down and you can see your name. Please verify that's what's going to be on your diploma. Right, you there. All right, and then select your address. Here's the deal. Put an address that you know someone's going to be there. If your address is going to be there, uh, like three months after you graduate, then great, put that address. If not, put mom, dad, uncle, aunts, grandparents, family, friends that you know will stay there, something like that, right? And if, if it's your temporary college address and you know you're not going to be living there, don't put that there. Your diploma will be mailed to that address. Yeah. So one just shows a intermediate technical certificate. Yeah, because we applied for the. Uh, if you want that, we applied for the associate for that. Right. So if you want that one, uh -huh. the ITC, which is the first year, you click on that. Oh. Give you an extra twenty dollars if you want to do that. But where do I go to check and make sure that my flight of graduate went through? I can check on that. Okay. What is the service review? It's the first year of the program. Everyone's eligible for it. All right, so once you get the address done, go ahead and click next. And I believe this should be the summer. Is that correct? Hey, Bill, I have a question. Yes. Um, if I am graduating with that certificate and uh, the BA, do I have to pay both of those fees? Yes, you do. It's twenty dollars per fee. All right. Thank you. Cool. Now talk to some of you. Some of you are continuing on. It's totally fine. Again, if you have questions, me, some of you already I've already talked to, so I know we all know your specifics, which is totally awesome. But other than that, you guys are good to go. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't want to be like confusing something. Oh, <laughs> they know what the graduation plan is this year. Say again. Uh, Do they know what the graduation plan is this year? Uh, no. I know we'll have a drive-through one if the, if like if it's like last year, and I'll tell you something. Everyone thought it's like the stupidest thing, right? But I did not. I saw everyone in that car grinning ear to ear. When they got their medal, we'll go through. So uh, it's not exactly. Question? Uh, are you? Are you? Uh, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. it, it's, I know it's, it, it's nice to have. What about? What about What about that RSVP email that we received to uh, to let let them know that we're going to be there? Yes. Is so regardless of drive through or not. Yes. So they're planning. They want to see how many people are going to be able to make it if they are to hold an in-person ceremony. Because here's the thing: they're allowing people to do sporting events. You saw that, right? Just recently, the high school events are allowing people to come back and, and watch high school events. Well, if they plan big enough for um, whole arena, okay. Maybe they have multiple ceremonies, and they can social distance. You know, that's what it comes down to. to the social distance of that. So they may hold multiple ceremonies to get through. So they're trying to gauge how many people are going to come. So if you were to have, if you if you want to come and have a graduation, put down, put down people. 
right? That way we get a number and we kind of get an idea. Again, that's not just called detect, that is universal. I'd look at the, I don't think I could see that. What was it, kids? What was the subject of the email? 